Hello, welcome to, to my studio, which is in Guadalajara, Mexico. And uh, I will be showing you um, basically my space and the inner universe in the place where I create and do most of the, of the work I do. This is some of the objects I'm putting together to create a new sculpture into which the process is, uh, is quite living and it's actually about just improvisation starting from a certain sketch and trying to make all these things come together. Normally in this uh, space, I, I use it for working these, these things. But then, for example, if we move forward, we'll see I have a place here where I do keep a lot of the materials I, I use, which are ready and bounded to start uh, working. And for me, organization is quite essential. And then I keep here another part of a smaller objects or materials that already have been selected for working sculpturally. I like to intertwine diverse materials that can actually have a dialogue, but they come from very different realities, from the very modern and constructed part of concrete to something very ancient as different stones that I gather around in different places. You know, I am in uh, Mexico. This is uh, the neighborhood I work in. It's um, quite a lively. It's quite a lively neighborhood, um, which it was founded in the 1800s, in which a lot of different artisans from around the city. Uh, came into this neighborhood and now it's called the artisan's neighborhood and there's a place where uh, it's a place where you can find all sorts of uh, tricks materials and basically everything you need so for having a studio here it's a it's a perfect perfect place really That it's my patio, my sky patio. And this is my personal library. Basically art and critical thinking with some excerpts of uh, a little bit of architecture and furniture design. But basically it's all it's all uh, monographies of mostly living artists and some classic periods. And outside there I have this path. Here it's my really personal place with my cat, yes, where I write some emails and basically um, it's also where I'm planning and drawing exhibitions and sketching things that I'm planning to do later on. And he's Benito. I recently participated at the Biennale of Sydney and just received yesterday in the post um, the catalogue 
which is actually a really nice one and um, you can see in the catalog um, some of my work that I realized I did at Kakatu Island getting some bits and pieces of the objects that were there and actually just make them part of like a, an installation about the very notion of heritage and about display and about mu museography and how things that are or seem discarded, in fact, they have a second life. And, and, and Well, now I have to go and work at the office on an upcoming publication. So that's what I'm going to with the rest of the, of the team. Um, all these objects, I will use them tomorrow to try to make a new sculpture. And I'm going to try to make all of this come together as, as one. And right now what we are doing is, is that we are taking these uh, elements up till, until the third floor for working tomorrow. And this is uh, another studio that I have just 20 meters away from my other one. And this is uh, mostly graphics and painting studio. Um, It's quite empty at the moment. All the materials where uh, we do the seal screening. And this is where we mount. and the mighty plotter. For me, it's very, very nice to come through this door and suddenly experience the secret jungle that actually takes me to my, to my library. So plants is something I really enjoy and really, really like taking care of. <laughs> 